Go, Darrington. Get outside. Go, go, go. Et tout tall, so go. For our second gameplay of the day, we are looking at the brand new golden ticket, Darrington Evans. And this card does look pretty solid. Is he the best running back in the game? No. Is he going to end the game as the best running back in the game? Probably not. I don't know where he's going to end as far as, you know, the running back rankings go. But um, the only problem with this card, I would say, I would say there's probably two problems. The first one can be fixed, and that is his stamina. They gave him 66 stamina. I don't know if that's a mistake. Are they going to fix it? I, I don't know. But that's just not going to cut it. Hopefully, we don't feel it today. But if we do... It is what it is, but 66 stamina definitely has to be addressed. Also, the fact that he's only 203. So he is 203, has a 99 truck, but you're still going to want to run Bulldozer with his weight because without it, he's not going to feel too powerful. So the plan today is Bulldozer and Leapfrog on Darrington. But outside of that, good speed, good agility, decent COD, um, good catching, and also going to be really good at running wheel routes because whoever made this card get, did give him 99 mid route running, which is actually the route running that you need for wheel routes so i wonder how nicely he's gonna run a wheel route also you know a good carrying good spin and a good juke as well but um yeah I'll just hop into the gameplay and um oh, also i want to show off the slots real quick so his ability slots i think he does get at least one of each so yeah two power one receiving and then two elusive so the plan today two ap bulldozer or sorry one ap bulldozer and one ap leapfrog but um yes now let's hop into the gameplay and also he does get titans and bears chems all right, here we go. We got game number one with Darrington Evans. We are facing a very good team. He's got Ed Too Tall. He's got Colin Johnson. He's got Cam Newton. Cold J7430 rocking the Rams uniforms. And we're starting this game off on offense. We are going to see Darrington Evans here early. Let's go. And I did a little bit of research and I, I found out that Darrington's silver card actually has 66 stamina. So it's probably a mistake. I don't think it's intentional for this card to have 66 stamina. They should change it. And let's try getting outside here. Darrington, first run of the day. In and out. Okay, there we go. You guys see the size right there. Felt good on the stick after the first run. And um, yeah, we got to start leapfrog and we got to start um, bulldoze and we got to start doing all these things. But again, the stamina hopefully doesn't screw us. Hopefully. Another stretch might just be the, op it just might be the only option. He's giving it to us. Run him over. And oh my... Cordero Patterson hit. Cordero, hey, hey, that's another thing. You're, you got a lot of these corners, man, that can hit now. You know what I mean? We got a lot of these guys that, <laughs> yeah, you don't want to run into, like, you don't want to try running them over, especially with the 200 pound running back. Even with Bulldoze, you guys see the result right there. That's that's scary. Does he have lane two? If he's got, oh, he's got Westry. Oh, boy. Okay, here we go. Off the edge. He actually did a good job, and we do get a first down. I'll show the RPO run again. Um, I think he knows what's kind of going on here, which does suck. But again, we do have not that 99. Oh, we, we may actually be fine here. Go, go, Darrington. Run, 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 run down the sideline. And there we go. Beautiful, beautiful. It's crazy how Ed Too Tall almost, almost has a foot on Darrington. But yeah, it, it's, it feels weird seeing Ed Too Tall like with, with those kind of speeds. And I feel like his strides actually make him just run faster. Like, I don't know what it is about him, but I think his strides almost give him like 110 speed sometimes. It, it's stupid and get open darrington at a boy gonna go ahead and catch that oh i was about to leapfrog too man we actually probably would have got by him too get me outside here again i'm going for the the journal throw it again okay there we go off the edge again and we might be able to punch this we should be able to punch this and you see what i mean by ed too tall so fast darrington evans touchdown let's go man 97 speed we're gonna go ahead and punch it in untouched block set up beautifully on that one and um even with the yellow stamina still um, look how fast dude ed too tall is too fast bro and uh was that a dc i don't even know what happened i was looking at i was looking at the comments on the mahomes video i'm also happy whoever made this card didn't like juice out his catching because you really don't need 99 catching on a running back like you really don't need it i mean yeah like sure whatever but you really really don't need 99 catching on a, on a running back like 82 is just fine on this card like you're gonna be more it's more than enough you know what i mean so I, i'm not tripping too much on that i gotta flip this back though why is this flipped like this maybe the the belly will work here oh we actually got good blo oh I, why did it skip me through the hole we did get a broken tackle on vita Vey, i think but why did it kind of just skip me like that and if we can't get one yard on a stretch i'd be kind of disappointed we should be we should, we should get one yard on an rpo there we go darrington on his back again damn still kind of mad about that up the middle and damn i thought we had him too 
All right, here we go. We're going to go stretch to the left here. RPO on that side. We do get a good block. Oh, good pancake right there. We're going to try running over Cam Chancellor. We say we tried it. So something lit up. What lit up right there? Good job. I went for the stiff arm. We get a broken tackle. It wasn't a broken tackle, but look at Darrington fall falling forward. All right, let's go with some Jurtles. Oh, I, that actually worked. Oh, my goodness. Oh, we get another broken tackle, but damn. Oh, if that guy wasn't there, we actually had like a perfect, like I actually found the open space on that, which usually doesn't happen for, for me on the Texas Open. He's wide open. Go, go make a play. Jurtle that back. Oh, uh, I thought I thought Colin was going to pick him up. He, he didn't. He's using it now. Oh boy. Oh boy. Throw it away. Oh, no. oh no. Okay. So kind of an anticlimactic drive. I mean, we, we went down the whole field to like the four yard line. What were we at the four yard line? Let me take a little sack there. He knew that play was coming. Oh, there we go. Darrington run, 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 go, go, go. Oh my. Pick him up. Go, go, go. I went for this stiff arm. I don't know why I went for this stiff arm. I got to do something else there, but let's go. Dude, finally a little bit of, a little bit of green grass for Darrington. He saw it late too. Very close. What's the stamina looking like? We're still blue. The middle again. Should be a pretty easy touchdown here for Darrington. Get up. Oh, there we go. Darrington? Was that clean? Nah, no, that was in a clean hurdle. That was in a clean hurdle. I kind of want to go one more drive. Okay. Okay. Go, Darrington. Get outside. Go, go, go. Ed too tall. So go. Darrington Evans down the sideline, Tutty. Let's go, man. Wow. Okay. Okay. We're actually putting in work. Hopefully, I cut up that first drive very nicely because. These last two drives have been the drives that have really stood out to me. All right, guys. So that is going to do it for the Darrington Evans gameplay. And I'm not going to lie. He played much better than I thought he was going to. And also, mid-game play, I'm not sure if it actually was fixed for game two or not. But um, he does have 98 stamina now. So thankfully, that's all sorted out. Um, this is just a good card. I think if he gets down to that like 200, 220 range... This is a good option to pick up. Is he going to be better than, you know, Vita Vea or the Mike Vick or some of the golden ticket running backs that might already be out? Probably not, but I think his price is what's going to make him a good option. Um, even though he did play well, I think those other backs are probably going to be a little bit more consistent. But still, yeah, felt good. The abilities are there for the, you know, different play styles, the bulldozer, the leapfrogs, the, you know, you can run evasive, you can run jukebox, whatever, run whatever you want on him. Also, speed felt good enough. He had a couple nice runs with him. Good, good pass catcher on the wheel routes, which is the main route that everyone runs with the running back. So a nice card. I, I'm a fan of this card for sure, man. He might stay around. He might stick around for the weekend. I don't know. We'll see. We'll see if Darren sticks, sticks around for the subathon or not. But uh, yeah, as always, I will see you boys in the next one.